I, I'll always offer because I don't go into a relationship with that expectation of somebody to take care of me. And like maybe that expectation is like exists in society, but I don't think everybody like goes into it in that with that intention. I, I also feel like it's not that deep. Like just Hold on, pay yeah. and enjoy the rest of your night. So we have a question for the men. Yeah. So if you guys got asked on a date by a woman, are you paying or are you yeah, letting okay. them? Yeah. Okay. So are you like okay like hey let's go on a date? Are yeah, you paying? I I really don't care. So it's, what if she tried to pay? Would you let her pay? Sure. She's like adamant about it. Like mm-hmm. I think there's like the like no let me pay and you're not gonna be jerk about it closer to the mic please that's yeah. cute you know what about you if a girl asks me out yeah she can pay for that shit ha! <laughs> would you say yes Jesus. yeah mm-hmm. i like it if a girl sends for me yeah? <laughs> yeah yeah fuck yeah it's so fucking rare it's refreshing hmm. yeah. that is fun huh no <laughs> yeah <laughs> if a girl so is, fucking is it a free fuck game fuck for yeah. us should we be asking men on dates well so i think you would have a very high success rate i mean really t- there's there's a couple different train of thoughts on this. I think some guys are like into this, like they want to be in their masculine frame. Yeah. And I think there's validity to that. And some guys are just traditional and they're going to be like, nope, I want to pay. Mm. Me personally, I don't think it's a turnoff if the guy pays. I think that's more fucking gangster. That's way more gangster than pay, than She's so into you that she's asking you out. She's paying on the date. You can still lead and be in your masculine, and she's simping for you. But That's like, some gangster shit. Do you like respect her less? No, I respect her more. Yeah, really. I, I, why I, see would you? I, I don't her less? see. Here's the because thing. what if he's gonna be like, oh, she wants me so bad, like she's like taking me out. Dude, I it's lo- rare. I it's really, just a nice thing dude, to do. it's kind of hot. Dude, I yeah. like it when a girl's <laughs> like kind of. I don't like it when a girl's like. How do I how do I explain this? She's if a girl, sugar mama. if a girl's like, for example, if she were to approach me and it was like in a really masculine, like, oh. hey, want to fuck? Like, like if assertive. it was super direct. Yeah. But if she approached me and she was kind of like coy and a little shy about it, okay. that would be f- super fucking hot. So same with like if a girl mm-hmm. DMs me first, it, if she went about it in like a tactful way, major turn on. Mm-hmm. And if she fucking pay for the date, I don't know. Maybe I'm gonna get dragged in the chat, but like. I mean, I think I'm, that's a positive thing. I'm super thing. down for it. It's also I'm encouraging. super down. If yeah. It encourages women to, like, sit in their power or mm. stand in their power and, like, not be afraid to maybe do something that might be perceived as a little bit more masculine. I think that's where that, that bridge yeah. of understanding is. Yeah, and I, I still like to lead. You know, I still like to lead in relationships. But if a girl is, like, I don't know, I, I kind of like it when a girl's like, I, see, I don't like this chasing idea or, like, mm-hmm. girls who play yeah. hard to get. But girls because like that. Like what? I feel like girls like to be the chased. Chase, yeah. Probably. They, when I would puts, feel wanted, like I would never ask yeah. a guy out first. Sure, sure. Even if I like someone. But but so I think the thing is though is that you like it because you're in a position of power. Because if the guy's trying to get you, you're in like a better negotiating position in the same way that that like for example, if I reach out to a company to do a brand deal. Mm-hmm. The, the, uh, they're in a stronger negotiating position because I went to them. But if they come to me, it's just like a framework where I have more negotiating power if they're coming to me. Yeah. And that's that's how basically women's position is. Women have a bunch of dudes coming to them, so they have like they have much more options. They're much more capable of being in the stronger negotiating position. So, but I would say women risk more when they're dating. I agree. I think it's a bigger risk as a woman yeah. dating. Yeah. Especially like I mean age, like if you're trying to have kids or anything, like men don't really have to worry about that. Like you can be 40 and go around and find some 20-year-old to But I I look and I I I because of I've had plenty of experience having to be the initiator because for most men you have to be the initiator initiator otherwise you're going to be bro, you're going to Divergent, bro. If, for <laughs> most men, if you don't initiate, like you're done. Yeah, because girls like a masculine guy that will come and like sure. show that they want them and like kind of work for them. Like girls want yeah. that. Like yeah. I feel like the whole feminism and everything they try to like to they try to break that down and they're trying to say that's not true, but it is. It's like human nature for women. Mm. Yeah. I think you think girls coming to you and like being like more assertive to you is hot. We think guys coming to us and doing the same but that's the default though that's the default so i'm i'm perfect perfectly capable of being the initiator i've done it for the vast majority 
of my uh, relationships. Although I, I have found that a lot of my relationships, the girls met me more, a little bit more in the middle. Like they showed a little bit more effort and interest where there's like, I don't want, a lot of girls will play like, not play hard to get, but my philosophy on being hard to get, if you're hard to get, you quickly become hard to want. So I don't want a girl who's like, I don't know. I like it when girls are like, I'm, I'm a really no bullshit guy, so I'm just, I'm the type of guy I'm like, hey, I like you, do you like me? Cool, we're good. I don't want a girl that's like where I'm on the, f I don't know where I stand with her. Mm. I kind of like, disagree. I feel like I, I want the guy to come to me, but I also want the guy to be kind of hard to get. Like I think my husband did that and it worked because he was like still hard to get. Yeah, it's like a weird dance. Like I feel like you need a little bit of both. Like it can't be too hard to get, but you can't also be just come and get me. I'm, I'm open range, open <laughs> yeah, season over that here. that means he's going to be for anybody. Yeah, I, like that's not attractive either. If you're too either. forward early on, yes. it's, like, it's like you said, it's this dance that you have to meet it. Yeah. If you're too forward early on, it's also kind of a turn off. Like, yeah. That's but weird. I think you're yeah. like right on the money when you're saying kind of like you're acknowledging women being in this position of power where like the guys are asking them out and so they're kind of the weak one where they might they have the chance of getting rejected. Yep. And I think that's kind of where a lot of this resistance and the kind of issues come up in these topics about relationships because we might think that because women are in that position of power we need to disempower them by teaching men like tactics that make them feel like they're in the position of power when in reality I think it's about seeing each other as like sentient beings like deserving of compassion deserving of love deserving of healthy relationships not yeah, about winning yeah, yeah sure um, I I'll just say at least for me and look, I, for the vast majority of my experiences with, with women, I would say, generally speaking, I've been the one who's a bit more taking the initiative. Uh, however, I, I'm not gonna lie and sit here and say, if a girl slides into my DMs, for example, that that's a turnoff. Absolutely not. And look, I can, I can lead it from there, but if a girl shows a little bit of initiative, and I, I don't want a girl in my DM like, let me fuck you, no, I don't want that, but just like, show you're interested, clearly, but it doesn't have to be this like really uh, abrasive thing. Yeah. Um, so, yeah. But I also don't like it if a girl like slides into my DMs and is like kind of coy with it and is like, "Hey, how's your day going?" I'm like, "Bro, just be." I, I like when girls are upfront. Just upfront. Hey, whatever. Thought you're cute. Whatever. <laughs> and uh, yeah. So, um, but to bring it back to paying, I also I don't like to pay for the first date. Actually, hold on. Let's do some chats here.